Hello everyone, this is Kate Barnes with Scott Leroy Marketing. Today I'm going to go over with you the new My Profile Within command. This is taking place of the KW White Pages profile that is no longer editable. Um, so we're going to jump into that. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go to command by going to agent.kw.com. As soon as we're there, we're going to log in using our KW command login username and password. Once we're logged in, you can click in the top right hand corner, that little arrow drop down, and you're going to notice that there's now a my profile option under the referral profile. This is separate from the marketing profile, separate from the referral profile. Again, this is kind of replacing the KW White Pages profile that you used to be able to view um, and edit. So that information will now exist here. Um, you'll notice in the top, it's gonna say the public facing information about you. Um, you get to decide if you want to turn that on or off. What that does is it, decide, or it decides if you want to be shown in search results to potential clients. So if you wanna be listed on the office website, if you wanna be able to be searched, um, that's the option you're gonna to wanna to toggle on so that people can find you. Um, so it's just a quick little on off button, super easy. It's gonna display at the bottom when that's updated. Um, additionally, you're gonna find that there is a My Profile and there's also My KW. Um, and you're also going to find your affiliations. Um, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at the About Me section under My Profile. That's going to allow you to edit your basic information. You can edit your HUD shot, your preferred first and last name, your biography, your language preference, as well as additional languages you'd like to have displayed. You can add service areas. Um, to here. And let's say, for example, the one that you want maybe isn't coming up. You can add your own. So you'll see that it'll populate some from Google. But let's say the one that you specifically want to show isn't coming up. You can hit add and it will go ahead and add that one for you. Um, if you have specialties, you can go ahead and add those here. Designations. Um, then you can save or cancel. You'll also notice that in this section, there is a real estate license field that unfortunately cannot be edited by the agent. So in order to have that um, license number or expiration date um, edited, you'll want to reach out to your market center. Um, generally, your MCA or assistant MCA can edit that field for you um, and get that up to date. You'll also find contact information. You can go ahead and edit that as well. Primarily, it's your phone number, save or cancel. Then we have the My KW section. Um, we have system information. That's going to be your uh, basic Keller Williams stuff. So your KW UID, uh, your primary KW email, your start date, your login details. So your KW username and password. You can also reset that here or edit that recovery email. Personal information. That's gonna be your home phone number, your email address, home mailing address, legal name, social security, date of birth. Um, you can also add an emergency contact here. Demographic information can also be edited here. Your beneficiary can be edited or added here. Um, banking information right here. If you have additional tax information you need to add, you can do so. Your sponsor, this can't be edited, but it is displayed here so that you can find it. Um, that is decided when you first join Keller Williams. So you'll already have that information selected for you. And then affiliations. So if your MLS information needs to be added, um, again, not something that you, the agent can edit, but your market center should be able to edit that information for you. Um, when you're up here in these profile sections, you'll notice that you can click on the specific areas. But also, if you just keep scrolling, it's going to take you to the next um, subcategory. I hope this video was helpful. Um, if you have any questions or tip video ideas that we can get creative for you, reach out to us at support at right there. Um, and we'd be happy to help. Have a great day.